Yo, yo, Daily Fire, if it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com. For all your supplement needs, go to Max Effort Muscle. All right, Daily Fire episode 327. It's scary. I'm actually typing this, but I'm not scared. So that's also pertaining to the most recent business thing that I'm working on, but it really pertains to anything. So when we, you know, pile a ton of weight on us in the meats, we're prepared for it. And it's a little scary to most people, but when you work on it and you develop yourself, you're not scared to take the weight. Now there's a difference Some days when you become scared, then that changes everything, right? Then you kind of know you're done taking big weights or you know you're done in business or maybe in that period of time, you're done with whatever you're working on. And so when I think about when I'm taking risk and a lot of people associate like Jesus out here taking all these risks, acting crazy, it's always calculated. It's always calculated to say, if this goes sideways, will I be okay? Now, there has been times in my life where that answer was, I won't be okay. And it would be really fucking tough if any of these most latest projects go sideways, it's going to be fucking tough. But once I evaluate that risk, I say, fuck it, and I'm all in. So the process of everything I'm doing right now with this island is completely uncomfortable. It's the same uncomfortability fucking shout out to that word right there. It's the same uncomfortable bill, <laughs> uncomfortability that, that I had when I opened my gym. It's the same. Shut up, daddy. It's the same thing that when I started this office, it's the same thing when we started muscle farm. It's the same thing. When we started max effort. It's a sa- It's always like that. So it's calculated risk. It's scarier along the process. But when you develop yourself and you push, you have to believe that you will have solutions that you're willing to put the work in and that being scary doesn't change because you're not scared. You see what I'm saying? You're not scared to try it because you believe in yourself. See, that's what I'm trying to get at is like a lot of people, gee, aren't you scared that it's going to be this or that, that you're going to run into? Aren't you scared that that's going to be difficult? Of course. I'm, it's scary, but I'm not fucking scared of it. I know that I believe that between the people around me, the people that I can call, um, I can find solutions. And at the end of the day, I think once you work on your confidence, whether it's physically and mentally, you start to believe in yourself to such a degree that you think no matter how long or hard it's going to take or what, how, whatever it is that I'm going to figure it out. And when you start to really believe and put that out into the universe and it's just intentional, it's just a matter of time. So it's not just an if, it's a when. And so when you're kind of going down these processes to start your own gym, start your own business, start this, start that, you have to realize that when it feels overwhelming, when it fear feels a little stressful, and you're a little, it's scary along the process because it's the unknown. Let, let me tell you something. Like everything I'm doing right now that's associated with that property is completely uncomfortable. I ain't never drove a boat. I'm, I've never been in charge of a boat. I never docked a boat. I fucking, I've never developed a uh, land. I've never ran utilities. I've never built my own house. I've never really cleared brush to this level. I just start, I just fucking changed my chainsaw blade the other day. I've never fucking done any of this stuff before. It's literally completely fucking foreign to me, but that's why I'm excited about it. Every time when I go out there, it's like I'm learning some new shit. And the reality is that when I figure it out, not only will I get paid financially from a business standpoint, But the lifestyle that it's going to create and the potential legacy that it's going to create is what gets me excited. The amount of time we'll be able to have with family and friends in a unique environment, the amount of business things we're going to be able to do here, it just turns everything up on the belief. So of course it's fucking scary, but I ain't scared. And the thing is you need to think about these things when you're taking risks. I've developed it. 
I've put it together. It's not going to be perfect, but I can get it started. And I believe in myself that I will figure it out along the way. So Daily Fire episode 327. It's scary, but don't be scared.